to be talking to you guys today. Uh, first and foremost, if you're watching this video, I wanted to go ahead and say Merry Christmas. I uh, hope you're spending time with your families. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And to all of our young men and women overseas, thank you for what you do. Stay safe. Hope you guys are hope you guys are able to relax a little bit today. Um, I'm Warren Maddox. This is Dustin King. We're both with Southeast Experience. Uh, for the last, I think, month and a half, we've been doing our nominations for our second annual Luke Hortenstein Memorial Turkey Hunt. Um, this is a disabled veteran or, or Purple Heart recipient turkey hunt. Um, we've done this last year was our first big one in Covington County, Alabama. Had a great time. Um, didn't kill as many birds as we like, but but by all means, we had a uh, we had a, a great time. And this year, we're hoping for it to be even better. Um, we're going to be at Cypress Landing Park again this year. Um, flying guys in, driving people in from all over the country. Um, I think we're going to have a corner of our list here. We're going to have our, our first couple of people from Texas and New York. So uh, without further ado, me and Dust are going to kind of go through. Um, we're just going to say the name of the person that was, uh, that was nominated, where they're from. And then uh, at the end of this video, we're going to be getting in touch with you guys uh, and, or, and or the people that nominated you. And we're going to go from there and get you guys all set up. So without further ado. The first person selected on Random Picker was uh, Melvin Page from Kingston, Tennessee. All right. The, uh, the second veteran picked was Crystal Frederick from Gist, Texas. Number three, Miles Bajort from Mobile, Alabama. All right. The next one is Dwight Blackman from Hattiesburg, Mississippi. And our next person selected is Blake McGee from Fort Worth, Texas. All right. Next is Nick Brown from Maryville, Tennessee. You would say make a hard one, wouldn't you? <laughs> Milt Yagel from Watertown, New York. No, All right. That's the hard one. Yeah, I, I got the hard one. <laughs> All right. Uh, this one is John Kasikako. John Kazikako. I'm sorry if I ruined that. Um, I'll be in touch with you, or we will be in touch with you. Everybody uh, that was picked, congratulations. Um, we want to say thank you for everybody that did a nomination. Uh, once again, last year we, we were flooded with, with nominations from all over the country, and this year was no different. Um, quite frankly, it got to the point where it was too hard to pick, so we had to start putting names into a random generator and go from there, and these are the ones that we, we were uh, left with. So. We are looking forward to having you guys in camp with us this year. Like I said, it's going to be a huge event. Um, this turkey hunt is going to be from March the 30th, which is a Friday, and will end on April the 2nd, which is a Monday. So it'll be a three-day hunt. Um, that's I think that's what the third weekend of Alabama's turkey season. Mm -hmm. So it'll be it should be getting into prime time. <clears throat> hopefully the birds won't be uh, won't be hinned up. We've had a good cold winter, and hopefully that continues. So yeah. uh, thumbs up. Hopes are high. Um, like I said, we will be in touch with you guys. I'll be sending either you a direct message or the person that nominated you a direct message and we'll be getting all your contact information. We will have some paperwork that everyone will need to fill out and we need to work out some logistics. So in the meantime, hope you guys have a Merry Christmas. Thanks again to everyone uh, that pitched in and that helped and shared and, and spread the word on this. And we cannot wait to get you guys in camp. So from all of us at Southeast Experience, Merry Christmas. See you guys soon. Ho, ho, ho!